So here is a magic reveal for Snart Smart Notebook. And this is how you build it. You're going to start by selecting the shape tool and picking rectangle. I'm going to make just a series of three rectangles. I'm going to select my rectangles and pick my colors. So I pick solid fill. I want this one to be maroon. Make my other one black. And I'm going to make this one whatever color. I gotta fix the ordering of these because this isn't in the front like I want it to be. Bring this to the front. A little bit bigger. All right. <clears throat> okay. Now I can do my rule. And now I want to change the color of the wording because I'm going to put it on the black rectangle. In the front, and I want to lock this in place just so it won't move. Bring this to the front so it will sit on top. Okay, and now I can make the actual number part. So I want to do 4 and 20 and I want to make the 4 the same color as that teal over there and the 20 the same color as this maroon so it'll disappear. So, but it sits on top. I want it to disappear under this rectangle just because I think it looks better. So I'm going to order, I'm going to send it back just one layer. Unfortunately this needs to get sent to the back. There we go. I'm going to send this one to the back as well because I want these colored backgrounds all the way underneath. And then I'm going to lock them in place just so I don't accidentally move them as I'm using this. I mean nothing's more annoying than being in your classroom and trying to move this around and you're moving rectangles instead. Now it goes underneath my rectangle and looks like magic. Uh, when you send it back one layer, sometimes it might only go under the rule. You might have to send it back an additional layer. Um, but that's it.